Well now the rain stopped, we've just come up to the greenhouse to look at the tomatoes and do some few basic tips and this one specially for Sophie and Felicity. So the garden's looking okay, a bit windswept and rain bashed. Um, we have got two lovely um, oops, allium, alliums there. So yeah, just looking for some warm weather so we can come outside and enjoy it all. Right, this is the greenhouse on the south end of the working garden. And as you can see, we've got some work to sort out the tomatoes to do. As I said, this video is <coughs> especially for Sophie and Felicity. So I'll have a start. Everybody does things a bit differently. We've left these a bit so we can side shoots a bit so we can show the video. So let's go in. <coughs> Quick show round. Um, out there is the dog and the raised bed. We have got purple basil. We have got these will turn orangey yellow. If you remember my pepper seeds didn't germinate on a couple of occasions so I had to buy a small plant but um, tended these and they're doing really well as you can see purple ones coming on brilliant some parsley there some purple basil cucumbers now <clears throat> tomatoes Different people's tomatoes are at different levels and tomato plants come in all different shapes and sizes but most people who grow them in a growing house will grow them like this. It's important you stake your tomatoes. Mine have been staked but with the weight of the foliage um, you do tend to get a lot of movement in the plant and the danger of them breaking off. Now, whoops, if I can use my other hand to film, I stake this and with the weight it's falling. So I need to brace this against the greenhouse because can you see how the weight is pulling the tomatoes? And the same here. So Andrew's going to get some string and we're going to brace them. Also, once we've braced them, we can go through and check. Now, we can take out side shoots. Why we take out side shoots is um, we want to give the energy to the main stem to ensure that we get big, large, succulent tomatoes. And we've also, just last week, as these were reaching a height close to the top of the greenhouse, pinched out the top growing spike. So, Sophie and Felicity were asking what are side stems? So, what we have here, there we go, is our main stem of tomato running down there with a side stem there. Now, I've left these to grow quite big so they're easy. This is the side shoots that are growing in between this leaf nodule and the stem. And we pinch that out. Now, some people, especially earlier in the summer, root these in soil and you get um, a second flush of tomato plants. Obviously, you've got to ensure that you've got reasonable heat or reasonable length season ahead of you so you can get a harvest. So go through. Find any of these side shoots, look down the stem, look across, and if you've got one coming out of the right angle, prick that out, um, pick that out. So here again, here's a smaller one, 
the main stem and we don't want that. Same here, main stem, leaf, prick it out, pick it out and um, go through all your tomatoes like this. Um, here we go, where are we? There we go, main stem, leaf, take out that side shoot. Down here, main stem, leaf, take out the side shoot. Let's show you once more. The main stem, there's a leaf there, we want to take out that side shoot. I will be doing the tomatoes and then we'll stake them up again to make sure they're solid and have got a good growing frame. Here's some first fruit. Some are tiny and some for the sake of filming so I can show you a big and you'll always find some big ones because you've not found them and the same on the other side and I'll do the same in the other greenhouse go through have a look take out any side shoots What is going on? 